We got the metal and it's going on the barn. All right, what's up guys? We are back out here at the uh, front fence line. I got reinforcements. What we're gonna do is there's a whole section right here. This big old tree, I don't know what we can do with and it goes down a little bit there. Uh, we gotta knock that out. So that's the plan for today. So with some of the stuff that we cut, yeah. it was actually your idea. Gotta give it to the goats. Yeah. They're gonna love this little thing. Yeah, that's plenty for all of them to eat for a whole week or so. Yeah. Yeah, we feed our animals enough. Um, no, we got a couple of them. We're gonna drag them over there. Um, I think this is a good time. If you guys don't know Brandon, this is my lifelong buddy right here. <laughs> uh, Mr. SV Thunder Road. Um, he is uh, do he's from Texas and he's been coming up he's been helping and stuff you guys probably saw him Crocker live live Show chat them. boom yeah. that's where it's at y'all yeah maybe available on bonfire soon coming soon I there don't know. you go uh, he is creeping up I don't even know by the time uh, this video comes out he may have already hit 3,000 yeah. but if not if you guys haven't checked him out check him out he's helping us out around here a lot um, he is uh, this just been a huge help uh, he, he helped us do the uh, hay rack um, which was such an awesome thing for old Lambo amazing Lambo loves it yeah and if you guys haven't seen go to the Crocker life check that out we've done podcasts together I think we just need you on coffee the Crockers at this point yeah yeah, yeah. Adult, it'll be full circle full circle <laughs> so guys check them out if you haven't but now we're gonna take the uh, trees to the goats Just gonna put the all the trunks together, and then we'll just tie these. Oh, they're gonna love this. Oh, I mean, that's a lot. I don't know if you guys can tell. We'll just tie these together. So the goats and animals will eat this stuff. Oh yeah. If we interesting, I didn't know that. You can let them out in the woods, dude. They'll clear it all. So eventually, when we get our whole fence by the barn, we're doing it through the woods so they can clear part of our woods. I think too, also the pigs would love this as well. You should drag it.
All right, guys. Brought the whole load over here. Come on. Hey, what is it, Woo? She belly the crap out of me. Oh, yeah. Karen's going to town. All right, guys, I'm walking over to the uh, barn build. I got the metal in and everything, but uh, huge thanks to Brandon for helping out. Uh, huge thanks to Danielle for helping out. And uh, you guys know last time I did that, it just took forever. I mean, absolutely forever for me to do it. Uh, it made it 10 times easier. Uh, it was just, to be able to just cut and someone's pulling, and then Brandon and I switched, and then Danielle was doing uh, some of the other stuff a little bit further away. Uh, teamwork, it really, really, uh, it does a lot. It gets a lot done. So I'm very thankful I got a good group around me. And uh, there are others out there as well that have offered to help. And uh, we'll have them out and stuff as well. As you guys can tell, uh, we got the uh, uh, fence and stuff right there. We're going to be working on that here in a minute because the barn's getting pretty pretty close to being finished so I'm coming over here to show you that uh, it's uh, it's crunch time it's time to uh, just dominate uh, but if you guys haven't checked out Brandon as feet Thunder road please check him out uh, he literally a lifelong friend he's helping out a lot he's doing a lot of stuff for us and uh, couldn't be any more pumped to have him out here uh, Danielle unfortunately had to leave she has to work uh, but she'll be back out again uh, we're gonna be knocking out the uh, Crocker life videos do some podcasts and all of that uh, I don't know I, I think you will be uh, pumped with what's going on but we're here at the barn and I want to show y'all what we got guys check this out it doesn't look like much but we got all the metal that we need for this barn and it's gonna go up right now. The metal goes up a lot faster than the framing as far as how I work. So uh, I am about to just throw this on the barn, get it going. Uh, you guys will see the finished product very, very soon, uh, start to finish and stuff on there. And then we'll be working on some more stuff, getting the fence done, get the animals moved. Uh, guys, literally couldn't be any more excited to get this and thanks to our neighbor he told us about a local place that's only 30 minutes from here where we could pick up supplies i'm just going to be very transparent with you guys i priced this metal at lowe's and it was going to be about six thousand dollars for metal to put on the shop we went to this other place and it was three thousand i know that sounds like a lot but i want to guess i'll add it all up but i think for the full build the uh, price is roughly going to be about $7,000 to build an entire barn, which is crazy because we couldn't even get a small carport for that. So building it myself, even though it's taking a little bit of time, is huge for us. It's saving us a lot of money. It's a big project. It is a lot of money to put into it, but we're saving a ton that we could put into other stuff around here. But guys, we got the metal and it's going on the barn. 